Hello everyone, welcome to another edition of Big Bear Comics Presents. Um, this is my uh, silent auction video preview for uh, Saturday, July 23rd, 10 p.m. Eastern Time on the YouTube channel called Blast It or Stash It and I believe this week it's hosted by Kirby's Comics. Um, there wasn't an auction last week, uh, they weren't able to do it but uh, as far as I know there's one going on this Saturday so uh, here is my preview for that auction um, the last two weeks none of those books uh, you know were able to sell I'm bringing a few of them back but I don't want to show the same books uh, I'll bring them back at another time uh, I'll slip a few in for this week but uh, let's show some new stuff alright I got um Marvel Double Feature number one. This is the um, the double feature edition of Captain America and Iron Man, combining in one uh, book to give you double the thrills. <laughs> and this is their first issue together. Captain America and Iron Man double feature number one. That's a good one to have. This is a nice high grade book. I would say at least a 9.0. Uh, let's see, we got um, Teen Titans number one. This is, uh, of course, George Perez cover art. You can see there. This one is in about an 8.5 shape. It's got a little bit of a corner wear, non color break increases. Uh, the spine is clean. So this is a very nice copy. I'm saying at least an eight and a half, maybe a little bit higher. This is the um, second appearance of Starfire, Raven, and Cyborg. And it also is the origin story of the team. So this is definitely, as you could see right on a book, a collector's item. <laughs> so pick it up while it's uh, cheap because there's uh, characters in there that once they get more prominent, such as Cyborg. This will be a hot book. Uh, this book is only going to go up. All right. All right. Next, we got a. This is a fun book. This is Freedom Fighters number one. Yeah, this is a uh, one where you want to have a hodgepodge of uh, DC characters. This is your book. I mean, all right, I don't think this is any of the first appearance of these guys, but you got Black Condor, Uncle Sam. Yes, Uncle Sam, let's see, he's only about 75, 80 years old. Yeah, but he's a superhero. Okay. And we have the Ray, Dollman, the Human Bomb. That's right, the Human Bomb. And uh, the only one I've actually really have heard before this book was the Phantom Lady. <laughs> So you got these guys in their own series called Freedom Fighters. This is a nice high grade copy by the way. Uh, it's hard to get a high grade on this book because of the black cover. But there is a spine tick or two um, here and here and there's a little color break there. So there's at least three little spine ticks. But still this book is high glossy, beautiful, not a, not a corner crease or anything. Uh, nice book to have. Yep, Uncle Sam is your hero. <laughs> okay, we got a. Uh, oh, this is a nice book that I've had before, and I've sold a sold well. This is a uh, Batman Adventures number twelve, the Comic Con uh, variant cover uh, by John Boy uh, Myers. And this is just, like I said uh, before, when I had one, this is like one of the beautiful covers I've ever seen. Uh, the colors just pop. The women just pop. They're a very, very beautiful book. Ladies' Night Out. You got yourself Poison Ivy, Batgirl, and, of course, Harley Quinn on the cover. And this is the uh, reprint of the original first appearance of Harley Quinn um, Batman Adventures number 12 and uh, pick that book up it's just a beauty 
Okay. All right, so I'm bringing back one from last week that I didn't uh, get to even show. Um, this is Legends number three. And since now we're even closer to the film coming out, The Suicide Squad, uh, I'm bringing it back. This is the first appearance of The Suicide Squad. Yep, they're here, and this is the book you want to get. It's a key, a first issue. I mean, the first appearance. This is Legends number three by DC. And I'm bringing that back, and, and that's going to be my Big Bear's Bargain Basement Blowout Special. So stay tuned for that price. You don't want to miss it. Okay. Now we got a. This is a cool book. This is a Marvel premiere number 38. This is the uh, first comic appearance by um, Weird World. It's got one of the coolest Dave Cockrum covers right here. If you ever want one of his better stuff, I mean, I love that. That is just awesome. And inside isn't bad either because you got Mr. Mike Plug doing the inside work arc. So, um, yeah, this is good stuff. It's the first appearance of Weird World. Uh, they just uh, re they had a currently had a series Weird World I believe it might have been wrapped up by now, or is it still con continuing I'm not sure, but there's also possibilities that uh, you know Weird World will be in the movie you never know and if that is true this book will be huge, so pick it up now while I'm selling it Jeep. All right here's a another uh, superhero that. Uh, Oh, is is like on a C list? You know, he's a C lister, but you never know when a C lister becomes an A lister, and we've seen that happen. So you never know that Black Lightning, number one, this book here, right now, you know, is an inexpensive. You can find this one is a nice high grade book. This one I would say an 8.0 to 8.5. Because of the black spine, there are some spine ticks that do break color, and you can see them because of that. But the rest of the book, wow. I mean, we've got super glossy, beautiful corners. It's a nice book. Black Lightning number one. I'm going to show that, I'm going to sell that pretty cheap. Okay. Here is a key book, guys, that, uh, you know, let's say there's some Archie fans out there or there's Teenage Story fans. This is a uh, key issue. Yes, it is. This is Chili, number one. Yep, Millie's red-headed rival. So if you're into the Archie stuff, back in this, this is like pure 70s written all over it. And it's fun. I mean, it's fun to read and go back and... Um, reminisce the times when I was in the 70s and things like this were all around me. The girls dressed that way, the girls act that way, the guys act that way. Uh, it was pretty fun. Uh, so this is Chili number one. It's a Marvel comic. Key issue. High grade. At least an 8 to 8.5. I may even slip out a 9 on this baby. This is a beautiful copy of a key issue. Chili, number one. Got to pick that up. Okay. All right, so I need your help, guys. Um, I really do. My uh, fiance goes through my lawn boxes of comics and she keeps singing, seeing uh, Vampirella and she keeps saying, um, when are you ever going to get rid of these half-naked chicks on the covers? Please get rid of them. So, I'm going to do her a favor. I'm going to try to sell all these. Um, <laughs> these are my Vampirella Harris comics. And yeah, so please help me out. I'm going to sell a set of, uh, let's see, one, two, five. set of five books at a really cheap price. I want to, I got to get rid of them. You know, this fiancé is not happy with those books. So we got uh, Vampirella number three there. This is Vengeance of Vampirella number three. This is, you can see why she considers these <laughs> a 
a must go. Uh, yeah. But they are beautiful art. She's not here, so I can say that. Okay, then we got Vengeance of Vampirella number seven. I believe this is an Adam Hughes cover. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong, but I believe I looked that up. And this is, you know, that's a hot cover too. This is all muscly there. Vengeance of Vampirella number seven. And we got Vamp Vengeance of Vampirella number 18. Okay, now by the way, all these are beautiful near mint plus books. I mean, there's not a crease, not a spine tick, not a dent, nothing on these babies. So you're getting really high grade stuff. And last but not least, the uh, Vampirella number 25. Vengeance of Vampirella 25, the uh, bondage cover. Like I said, these are just high grade books. And I gotta, they gotta go. So help me out, guys, on an auction. Okay. So, um, that's it. I um, hope you enjoyed that. And by the way, I have some graded books also. But if you look at my last two videos, it'll be the same three books. So, I didn't want to bother showing the same books again. So, uh, if you go back and look at those two videos, you'll see the uh, three graded books that I'm going to show for sale. Um, so, that is uh, Saturday night, July 23rd, 10 p.m. Eastern Time on the Blasted or Stash It YouTube channel. Hope to see you there. Uh, this is Big Bear signing out.